if you've ever been to any Baylor football games, then you've probably seen a man on the field with a camera and this blue hat. Well, his story and the story behind the blue hat is one you'll definitely want to hear. Hey, that's mine. <laughs> hey. Uh, Nice Meet work. Robbie nice Rogers. Work. He got his degree in photojournalism at the University of Missouri, has spent time okay. working with various yeah. newspapers, and today he is the director of photography and video for Baylor University. <laughs> Mr. Rogers has a love for sports photography and journalism, so his goal, like many others in his field, was to work for Sports Illustrated. I started off simply of just dreaming about it, and then I figured out a way to actually try to meet some of the editors. He got to meet with a few editors at a workshop in San Antonio for an Olympic trial where he showed them his portfolio he had been working on for 15 years, but... And they told me it was awful. Um, but I did have the energy and the wit about me to say, well, if I ever make a good picture, can I send it to you? And they said, yeah, sure. So he then sent Sports Illustrated a postcard with pictures he took every week until... I finally got a call to do this one game in the middle of, sorry to say, nowhere, North Alabama. From there, you know, they just kept calling every week. And his photos made the cover of Sports Illustrated two times, including his photo at the Orange Bowl when Tom Osborne and Nebraska won their first national championship. While my dream was to work at Sports Illustrated, I guess my greater dream was to do, to work at the very top of my level every day. And, and I'm glad I was able to do that. Now, what's so special about his blue hat? Well, besides the fact that it's SPF 95 and helps keep him focused at games. When I put this on, all of a sudden I'm in a zone. I can, I can concentrate. Sometimes I wear earplugs, but this is sort of like blinders for a horse. Most importantly, his good friend Jerry Wachter, who is the scene photographer for 37 years of the Baltimore Orioles, passed away due to skin cancer. During his you know, final years, I'd worked with him and helped him out some, and I just knew that uh, this would cover me the same way that Jerry would want it to be. Even though he's met many famous people and has covered huge sports games, Mr. Rogers said that you get to see amazing things as a photojournalist, but there's nothing more amazing than what's to come. And that's why I love being at this place. It's, it's the next picture that's going to be here. For Lariat TV News, I'm oh. Elizabeth Tharp.